We begin with a News 8 exclusive. A woman thought she was buying a dog online. Tonight she's heartbroken and out several hundred dollars. Yeah, the Better Business Bureau says it's hard to know how often these types of scams happen because a lot of people just don't report them. News 8's Renee Schmiel live in News 8 Control tonight with more on this exclusive story. Renee. Darren, Anna, if you buy something from a website like Craigslist, which is what this woman did, it's considered a private transaction. So, in other words, you're not protected. But if you're online, it's not always that easy to tell the difference between legitimate sellers and crooks. Email me pictures of the mom and dad. This is the mom with her litter, 11 puppies. Debbie, who didn't want to give her last name, had bought what she thought was this German Shepherd puppy. Her last dog had died a few years ago, and she was ready for another dog. She was going to name him Duke. For my birthday, and uh, we're not going to get one now. Uh, I mean, he's not here. She wired her payment, and, is, and a company um, called Pro Pet Travel was going to ship the dog from Arlington, Virginia, this past Tuesday. Instead, she got a phone call saying the puppy was not insured, and she'd have to pay more than $600. I said, you're scamming me, aren't you? And at that point, I just started crying. After she told the alleged pro pet travel employee that she was going to the police, she was not able to get in contact with anyone she'd been dealing with. Thomas, it's Debbie, and I am still waiting on that puppy. The phone numbers all through Google Voice. Debbie says the company looked legitimate, and everyone she spoke with had an answer to all of her questions. I thought I wouldn't be taken advantage of. Meanwhile, the Better Business Bureau has heard of scams like this. Spokesperson Howard Schwartz says if a seller demands a certain type of payment, especially if it's untraceable, be careful. And doing business online can be tricky. If you're going to buy a dog or a refrigerator or anything else for that matter, you want to see it first, see if this is the type of person you want to deal with. Debbie won't be using Craigslist again. And she left the crooks who scammed her a message. I said, thanks for scamming me and hurting my family. I hope you carry this with you for a lifetime. The Better Business Bureau says another thing to watch out for if you're looking to buy a dog online is some dogs that are for sale have been stolen, so make sure to get proof of where the dog came from. We reached out to Pro Pet Travel for a comment, but we have not heard back. Live in News 8 Control, I'm Renee Schmiel. Anna and Darren, back to you.